Good morning, guys. A bug's life. It's about 8 in the morning. The workers are going crazy. You can probably hear it. I don't know. I figured since I have no chemistry results for the report I'm about to write, I decided I would consult myself to this. Um. Will be this will be full completion from start to finish, not in one episode, obviously, but fully completed nonetheless. So, because I have no life, we will be doing the training stage, not the way they want me to. It will be in my own style. Press square button to throw red shit that can turn into green, blue and green shit and in sometimes gold. And when you press X you levitate because the laws of gravity in the physics world work like that. And when you double jump, even though that doesn't happen in real life, you stomp on shit. And then you can pull things up and down to then throw them even farther away. And then when you do set double jump, you destroy things because that's how physics work. They also work the same way that you can pull up shit and throw it again. Then because it exists, you can pick shit up and press triangle to press and change things and then they turn into different shit. Then you can pick up more of these to make them stronger, more longer and uh, well, what not. And then you can do this and do all that. And then you get all the way up here. Then in order to get 100% completion you have to gather all 50 grain, spell all 4 letters and kill all enemies with the golden berry. This is blue shit. It has a homing thing. No, it doesn't. The green and purple kind do. The blue stuff has a splash effect. And when we pick these up, we can make our own berries stronger. And we need that to get the golden berry. Although in certain cases, you can just find it there. But that will be the only golden berry you will be able to ever get. <sighs> Did that make sense? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, 50 grain restores all your health, all letters give you an extra life, and enemies will come back unless killed with a golden berry, which we now have, or will be able to get. So, we do that, this blooms, and we have this shit. Strong splash effect, and enemies will stay dead forever. Why these ants are different than others, I do not know. But whatever. <coughs> Anyways. Do all that and you have done 100% in one stage. And when you do that you get bonus movie clip. But why they would even include that considering how badly pixelated it is. And the fact that you could just watch the entire movie. I do not know. For whatever reason it's laggy. But it doesn't really matter now, does it? Nope. Now let's do the real deal, son. Okay, that's everyone. Can't believe that shit took me five minutes. Fuck that. Find the entrance to the anthill. Why things now look different than they did before, I do not know. Let alone even care. Yup, brings back memory. Memories. It's almost like they never vanish. How lovely. There are also certain bonus stages that need to be completed and you need to do special things in order to access them. Um, the first one can actually be accessed early on, and I will be doing that. For the moment, not now. Yep. They have... they are conveniently called homing berries, the green one, because they home in on their enemies. <laughs> Funny. The harvester makes you invis invincible and destroys enemies like the gold berry effect. Only one problem, you can't jump with it. So you have to adjust to that and just accept it. And then go cry in a corner because it sucks. 
Whatever. For now, let's just move along, find different shit, and make things happy. I recently got my hands on the Hardfire mod, or DLC for Skyrim. Pretty cool, actually. And pretty cheap, too. Yeah, they suck. <laughs> Anyways, in accordance to the rules of the bonus world, like you probably saw the exclamation marks, well, I think you did. <laughs> um, rules will always change, but I won't go over them until I actually will do them. Like, I tried to say that the, <coughs> the green and purple berries are homing, the blue has a splash effect, sort of, and, well, you should be able to guess what that actually means. Let's see, can we get this one? We did. Oh yeah. Now we have to do this, because apparently life still doesn't make any sense. But I guess it's a metaphor for the fact that we obtain knowledge in very, very weird ways. But you don't really need to collect them that much in this stage. They become more imperative in the next stages because otherwise we wouldn't be able to complete that said stage 100%. But that day that sorrow, which is quite near, and considering this game isn't that long, well, you know what it should mean. And that's actually what it means. Yay. Let's see. What shall we do next? Other than what we've been doing since we well started. And we have to get up there. Now we're gonna have to go back the other way in order to do so. <sighs> and this is quite... <clears throat> quite a bad position for my hand to be in. Considering the microphone is in the way and shit. Could do post commentary, but I didn't think that would be nearly as interesting in other cases. Or as it could have been. Yay. Now let's see, we do this. You can actually reach it from here, but the jumping is. It's hard to do right, and I rarely do it right anyways. So may as well do it correctly the first time, shouldn't we? Anyways, finding more shit to kill. Because they infest our homes and rape our wives. Or since we're ants, our wife. Ah, one big incest infested. Island. <laughs> Incest Island! Where we all do things our way. I don't know. <laughs> this is a shield, protects you for 3 hits, and you can take a total of 5 hits before dying. Very good to keep in mind, honestly. No, really, it is. Ah, uh, killing things, killing things, because that is how I make my living. I didn't even know I made a living. Actually, my living right now is studying. Damn, is it fragile. Something. Damn it. <laughs> don't know, don't know. Hardly even matters. And that means we now have to deal with four more things before we're done. In any basic term. Damn it. And three more. They should be down here. The impure ants. Uh, the sound of these workers fixing the floors and stuff. Sounds like a bull drilling a, drilling a hippo. How that makes sense? It doesn't. And we're done here. Yada yada. Bonus movie clip.
You could just watch the movie, but whatever. And that's it. But we're not done just yet. There is still the bonus stage to do, and I will tell you how to do that shortly. You could do it later, but considering how early it is, may as well do it. And I lied by saying one bonus stage, because I will be doing two bonus stages. I know, isn't that exciting? Okay, need that, because we need a special thing that will make us able to progress. Uh, gotta get this. And then we do this, and do that. Then we get up here to pick up this shit. Now, there's one little trick you can also do. Press the square button and the X button will degrade it, only for a set amount of time, because nothing wants to be like it should, and can be. So whatever. Now let's see, we need to take this, do that, and then do that. It will allow you to levitate seats, which we need to do, Otherwise, things will not go the way we intend them to. Let's see, there wouldn't happen to be one up there, would um, would there? Mm, let's see, nope. Well, I guess that's it then. We only need three more seeds, and then we can do what we're supposed to do. Because nothing makes sense in this world. But it's a fantasy world, so who even gives a flying crap shoot? Yay. Expert hit. Expert kill too. Okay, we already have two up there. So we'll send that. Destroy that. Kill this. Pick up that. I'm lying. Get hit. Kill that. Throw a bunch of shit because we even gives a crap. That's invincibility, by the way. And sometimes they throw bogus stuff like that just to piss you off. And sometimes it's the only thing that wants to show up out of a million items because it doesn't want to show up with what it's supposed to. That second shield, shield seed. Bleh. Fuck that. And then we need this as well. Now we have five seeds, or five, all the five seeds we need. Now we'll take each of them one at a time until we're fully happy with ourselves. Because we don't have a choice in the matter. And that does that, we only need two more now. That originally something I figured out myself. If I ever triggered a bonus stage, it would always be at complete random. Like, I didn't know how you triggered them, they just happened. So I figured you did something specific in a stage, but for whatever reason, I could never figure it out. Then you look up on the internet and find random stuff. So that's how it goes. Now the final seat so that we can enter said bonus stage. And the bonus stages have honestly no use other than Well More movie clips. Yeah, that needed a dramatic silence, because otherwise we'd think we'd be in an asylum. Need five mushrooms, then jump on each one, or from one to another. We get a jetpack by magic reason and we enter a bonus level by entering the air like a bird. Yeah. Yay. 
Okay, find the exit right over here to jump over. And then you need to push up here and make it to the top for the exclamation mark. Not too hard now, was it? Well, the second one gets harder. By a lot. The beast has been tamed. I couldn't help but saying that. <laughs> Whatever. And time for the second bonus level. And if I got, forgot to mention, because I most likely did, there's a total of three. So remember how to double jump. You need to land on five enemies in a row like that. We already did so with one. That's two. That's three. That's four. And that's five. And like I said, the second one... Fucking hell is it difficult. Ugh. We need to collect a bunch of things. Otherwise... Life won't be nearly as good to us. But there's a few starter ones that we can collect. Then we need this one. And no, we're not at all done in a second here. It takes quite some time. So anyways, put seed here, then you get that. And then jump up like... Oh, no, like so. And then you somehow need to get this seed out. Like that. Ugh. <sighs> Now let's move them one at a time. Don't believe we can do that one just yet. I believe we have to get this one over here first. At least that would make sense from a perspective viewpoint. Which I still don't have. <coughs> let's see. Time-wise we're doing like I hoped. Damn it. Uh, pick it up, and then tr fuck. Now, that's not how it's supposed to be. Like this, and then we pull it around, or lift it around, technically. Good technical, dude. <laughs> no. So we get up here, then we get that. And I'm going to keep the fake idea that this will actually work. At least I hope so. That means things in life will be a lot easier. And like this. It should get us higher than the other one. That did that. Now we have maximum. And then we do it like this. Alright, now we need the other seed again. Because we're still not done with dumb shit over and over. Pulling this and doing this. We now need it on the other side so that we can pick up the other... other tokens, whatever. Uh, let's see, like... Unless we can do things like I hope. Yes, we could. Last time that didn't work. Ah. Let's see if we can do this right. I don't know where it is. There. Damn it. Um, while sliding and hitting an enemy, you also kill them. But it's kind of weird. Especially since most of the time you're not even going that fast. Or fast. But I want to reach it. 
damn it. Never said this was gonna be easy. And I'm not about to say it will be. And just to point out right now, if you die here, no second chances, you'll have to reach it all over again. Yeah. Oh, shite. Ugh. Freaking impure ants and shit. Uh, moving along. Damn it. Sometimes you might get lucky to get health power-ups, but it's... They don't happen too often, sadly. Now we just need to position ourselves so that things will go like we want them to. Uh, most of the time it's hard for me to see exactly where. I think it's here. Now let's try. Boom, bitch. The third one is easier. Ladybug automatically makes me a girl. Is that it, Flyboy? Huh? Christ, she's a girl. She's a guy. <laughs> oh, you assholes! All right, that does that. Next time, the tunnels. Whenever that will be. Um. Yeah. Peace out. <laughs>